Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And um, if you've been having some issues or if things aren't going the way you want, you moved to 25H2, you've got connectivity issues maybe, and you're on Intel hardware, well, Intel just released for some hardware 25H2 uh, specific drivers. So uh, they are for Wi-Fi and Bluetooth and uh, they should be fixing some issues. Apparently, some people had some connectivity issues. So uh, if you have, for example, here I've got a Bluetooth device, which is uh, so in Intel Wi-Fi 6, for example. This is, of course, um, the, um, the Intel drivers that I would need. And, of course, there's also the uh, Bluetooth here, which is... Uh, um, is that an Intel? Um, nope, it doesn't seem to be an in Yeah, it is Intel wireless Bluetooth. Here it is. Look at that. There we go. So Bluetooth and Wi-Fi on this machine are both, um, are both Intel. So if you've been having issues now, I always get the question is, you know, should I upgrade or push these drivers if everything is fine? Personally, I wouldn't touch anything. Um, if everything works fine with Bluetooth and Wi-Fi on your machines, just ignore it. Um, this I would probably use mostly if you have problems with connectivity because um, that could fix the problems. There's a lot of the problems in Windows and connectivity and, and all different hardware that are often driver um, problems, not Windows problems. And of course, these drivers are specific for 25H2. So anyways, I'll share this page. You can go and check out if there's anything uh, useful for you. And if everything's all right, uh, just ignore it. So those were released on October 30th, which is today. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.